opening your hi-hat can add so much to your drum grooves, so you best learn how to do it. Here's a good place to start. We're going to play an eighth note groove, really simple, one and two and three and four and, one and two and three and four and, one and two and three and four and. Not that fast, don't worry. And when we get to the and of four, we're going to lift up the left foot and then bring it down on one. It's really common in eighth note grooves like this to find an open hi-hat on the end of four, which is why we're putting it there. One and two and three and four, open, close. When you come to the close, it's on one, remember, so you're going to have your hi-hat right hand coming down and your bass drum coming down at the same time as your left foot. So if you wanted to take baby steps into four-way coordination, this is the place to be. Open, close. Open, close. Take that as slow as you need to to get it right. It's not about getting it fast, it's about getting it right. Once you've got that down, the only rule of thumb I'd say is if you're playing an eighth note groove and you want to put an open hi-hat in it, make sure that your hi-hat opens and then closes on the next eighth note. So say we put an open hi-hat on beat one, you'd then close it on the and of one. One and two and three and four and open close. Also try to make sure that the left foot closes the hi-hat before your right hand comes down on the hi-hat so you don't get any weird flammy open hi-hat-y noises that you don't want. So enjoy adding open hi-hats to your eighth note grooves.